hello everyone happy sunday i don't know if anyone is available to jump on but if not that's okay you can just watch the replay i'm actually about to do my nails the kids are not home for probably five more minutes <laughs> so i wanted to show you i get so many the light is i love that we have so much light in this house but it's difficult to make a video when i'm not you know against the, the light and i wanted you to see my nails so i have to sit in a spot like this so so many of you ask me how to yeah my hair is terrible <laughs> how to uh, use a strip that's too wide either because your nail is too short too narrow like your nail bed or because you want to use those leftover strips that are not the perfect fit so i wanted to go quickly and show on a couple of nails um, before I just go and then I will do the rest of it myself so I already put I told you I'm not using the aqua white because my nails are so dry I use the um, OPI nail strengthener and you cannot see it but I can send you the link if you are interested in so I'm gonna use the um, never forgotten and if you read I posted how that we have struggled to get pregnant Laszlo had a twin who we lost at the early pregnancy and then I had another miscarriage between uh, Laszlo and Ildiko so when I get these strips um, I knew I want to wear at least once and I know that a lot of women are affected by this um, so I think that they made it still available on the website if you know anyone I feel this is a very um, touching gift to you know it's a little thing that just lets them know that you you feel for them that you are supporting them um, unfortunately there is even today a lot of women who is just going through infertility um, pregnancy loss or even infant loss so I already told you I'm taking the strips always um, I take it apart and then I'm gonna sh turn my camera so you can see, hopefully, what I'm doing here. Here you go, so it's... Here, so I'm gonna... Let's see. So usually I use the, this one on my uh, pinky. The narrower side is just perfect so i will i've used this on one and, and i'm gonna show you so this one is the same pattern so i'm gonna use this on my pinky you see it's like much wider than it should be so what do i do when this happens i take off you know this part is the same i take off the silver tab and i like to go and uh, line up let's see is it yeah line it up on one side so you don't have to worry so you see how this is perfectly lined up and then i smooth it on my nail and you see it's much much wider you see how much left to right i mean i exaggerated when i put this one on purpose because i wanted to show you this very specific situation. So I want to keep the other side. So first what I'm gonna do, I just take off the extra and I take off the tab and I, I know this is usually this finger, so I'm just gonna put this on this finger, which is gonna be a, a perfect fit. Actually even my nail bed is pretty narrow. Like you see even this has a tiny little bit of extra you see how it, so if you leave it like that it will curl back and that's how you will end up with the chipping so you want to go you can so there is two ways if you have longer nails like mine then you can just go and that's what i like to do i just go like this and i i feel it's easier also because i i can really feel what i'm doing when i use my nails so i really make sure that it's nice and smooth on both sides and then i just i like to you know that's another thing i like kind of just like 
fold it over and almost like tuck under versus just pushing it down or filing. I feel that this helps a lot with the, the wear on the top of the nails. And as it dries, it shrinks just a little bit. So if you are filing it down and it's right at the tip of your nail, you will see that right of it will show like a tiny, tiny, tiny little bit like it's not covering your nail. So you see, I, I like wrap it around the edge. And if you have been and watched what they are doing at the nail salon, I observed it, especially the pedicure, they always go and like paint like this, the tip too. So you see, I just get the extra of just like this. And then I will show you on my other finger where I have much more extra. So you could go with the flat part of an orange stick and just go and do the same. Like you see where my nail ends and you just want to press it down on that line. And if you do it with the flat part, it kind of like smooths the rest on your nail. So that's why it, it works great. I personally don't like to use the orange stick. I feel there is a bigger chance that I'm like scratching this side. I like to go with my nail just like this, but you can just go with your orange stick and remove like that too. So you see it has been quite a little bit of extra, but once you are done, it looks perfect. So let's see if I can show on one more nail. Yeah, so let's do this. This is also wider. Isn't that cute with the little butterflies? So again, I take off the top and then you see my, my hands are trembling even though I don't think about the loss a whole lot and I'm, I'm so grateful that I have two healthy children who are full of life. It's still, you know, especially moments like this when I'm applying a nail set that is about pregnancy loss, it's, it still makes me a little bit jittery. So again, I try to line it up with my cuticle line and then one side of my nail and I smooth. You see how this is perfect on this side. And then I go around. Again, I like to use the other, so I will just take off first the extra. And if you don't care, you can just pinch this whole piece and then, um, you know, throw it away. I don't like wasting. I was raised that, you know, you finish your plate and you don't waste, you never know when something will be good for something, so. So it's actually gonna be too wide on this one too. My, my nails are pretty narrow to begin with. So again, I just go and you, on your own finger, you feel where is the, right when your nail and the cuticle line meets. So I just go around, see, so kind of making a hole there, perforating away. And then I just go and pull it away. And then I, again, I go, I wrap it around and I just press it down to take away the extra. And even, especially if you do it at night, I don't even mind if I have a tiny little bit of extra because it will wear off as you use your fingers, but it will really help with them with the tip of your nail. So, here you go again, I go around, and I, and I just take the extra away. So here is it. You, it's very important that you don't leave extra on your skin here or you don't put it on your cuticle line because that's when, as it grows down, especially there is a gap here and it would lift up 
and that's how you get chipping otherwise this stuff does not chip if it chips reach out to me or whoever is your stylist and let us know because it's almost always application error you might didn't use you know clean proper your nails before i had one mama who like put lotion on her daughter like two seconds after applying the nails so here you go i have four nails done i'm gonna turn back the camera here um, so i hope that you find this helpful let me know if um, if you have any questions um, if you had issues with uh, you know not being able to use um, a bigger strip i know because i am uh, more of the petite size my nails are skinny i um but you know there are so many more so many more choices i can't speak even uh, in the normal line so i always use this one but um or almost always but it's nice to know how to make it work for you so i'm loving what do you think about this set i'm absolutely in love so thank you so much if you have been watching the video um, let me know in the comment what you think if you have any issues don't hesitate to reach out i hate when someone like i reach out later and they say it didn't work for me and then it's like we could figure out because it's really so simple but there are some some people need a little bit more of a practice or explanation and if you haven't seen for example this you might not figure it on your own so don't hesitate to reach out to someone who have been using these strips for a long time because there is a solution so uh, here you go yeah it's terrible with this light we have beautiful beautiful windows in the back like everywhere but it also means that sometimes it's difficult to find the perfect spot to make a video so anyway have a great weekend sunday evening everyone um, and uh, happy monday tomorrow bye